everyone! Welcome back to Salmon and Cod Playtime! In the past two videos, we've played with our little cat protractor that we made here at our house because we thought it was super cute. But I wanted to show you what a protractor you could buy in the store looks like. If you go to any store, well, stores that sell these, sell school supplies, you could find a protractor like this. Now, this one's in pink, okay, and it looks like this. This little circle right here in the middle, if we had an angle, let's draw an angle, a random angle here. Okay, if we had an angle that looked like that, we would take this protractor, and do you see the middle of the angle, the middle dot right here? Well, there's a little hole in this protractor, and I know it's kind of hard to see. There's a hole right there. That hole has a reason. You're going to put that hole right there on that center dot, right there, and then your protractor has a line that goes right across here. That tells you where your zero line is. You are going to line that up with that first line right here. And you're going to line that up with zero. And then this has numbers all the way, all the way around here. Okay? You're going to line it up. And those numbers are going to tell you what angle you have, just like the kitty cat ears did. Okay? It looks like right here, it looks like we have an angle of, what is that? It looks like 130 maybe? I think that's 130. There it is, an angle of 130. Okay, 130. So we would actually write that, since I'm on a roll, we would actually write that 130, 130 degrees. 130 degrees, that's how we would write that. Now, they're not always pink. I had to buy this one special to get a pink one because I'm a girl and I like pink. You can also get a smaller one. If you wanted a smaller one, you can buy them smaller. They still tell you the exact same angles. It'll still follow the same line up. It'll still follow the same lines. This one's just smaller. It also has the hole in the middle. I don't know if you can really see that, but it's got a hole in the middle to show you where to put it on here. It has the line to show you how to line it up. And it also says that this is, let me see, I don't have it lined up. If I would line it up right, it would probably go best. Yep, I said 130 last time. Look right there, it's at 130. Good job. All right. Normally when you buy them in the store, they're going to be white, and they look just like this. It works the same way. There's that little hole in the middle. There's the line you line it up with. And here's your numbers going around the outside. They also have a ruler right here if you needed a ruler. It's got a good ruler there and another ruler right there. Pretty fancy diddly. This is a kit that I just got in the mail yesterday and I was so excited about it because these just make me excited. If I can show it to you. You can also, if you want to be super fancy, you can buy little cute ones that have little kawaii animals on them, and I just thought it was super cute. I don't even think you can see that with my camera. You really just can't, but it's super cute, and it came with a set with the rulers. There you can kind of see it. it. has rulers, and then if you needed practice writing triangles or straight lines or whatever you needed, it also came with little triangle ones that have a ruler on the side, which is really great because when I go to draw these angles, and you know I can't draw a straight line to save my life, I could draw my little dot, and looky here, I could use this to draw my straight lines. Oh my goodness, that, <laughs> my kids are going to be so proud of Mama. They're going to think Mama has advanced because that was a great straight line. Let's do another one. Ready? Just use your ruler here. <gasps> Oh my gosh, it might be the straightest line I've ever drawn in my life. And that's why these are really great, because they can help you to draw straight lines so that you get your math just a little bit better. So that looks just a little bit better and a little bit more accurate. But I just wanted to show you what some of these fun things are. We love toys around here, and if you can't do math with toys, then why do math? There's no point. I love these. These make these these are toys to me. They are so much fun. I like to play with these all day long. So just wanted to show that to you and just wanted to show you what you can play with too at home. All right. We'll see you all later, okay? <laughs> Bye.